this art right here, that's purpose. What an interesting bicycle. They welded the top longer and put a steering wheel. Looks like a challenge to ride next to the food bank. Okay, this old brick building I find interesting. It used to be a laundry. COD. Alright, so you get a bit of a view of uh, Lewiston. Some grape, grapes. Don't want to have too much, too many more of those. So sour. The library is not visible. Yeah, there's the train bridge is just over there. I only see one pillar. That's strange. Maybe that's not it. All right, wrapping around here. No trespassing. Violators will be prosecuted. Well, who's gonna? You gotta break two locks to to get in there. So then I won't get in there. Wow, this building is really falling apart. That's a big crack. So I was interested in getting on the second story, but yeah, I didn't expect to be able to. So this is second best. Just get kind of a peek at the area, looking down on it. I don't want to really expose myself too much. Yeah, not too much to it anyway. I don't really know what I would want to zoom in on, <laughs> except for this abandoned building. Completely worthless. Taking up a lot of real estate. So it's right next to the hospital, which is over back there. Liquid air core. It looks like it could use a new tank. Smells like pee. I think these are apartments. Most likely. Wow, it's got a it's got a bad smell. I think this boat sculpture is really something. Yes, it didn't look like a boat sculpture from the distance. I think the bridge looks kind of neat. The blue bridge. Let me, also, let me also just say that somebody's living under here. I saw somebody come out with his dog. He begs on the corner. All right, so this time I have my key in the ignition and the door, the door sound is not letting me know that the door is open so it's an off and on thing that this bicycle is causing with the door but it's most likely the bicycle that's causing the problem I'm driving to Walmart to the the Lewiston library I'm an hour early sweating right now my gut is in, in, in a lot of pain at times I kind of like the pain but I kind of don't it's, it should, I shouldn't be having pain, actually. The gut is not designed to be painful. The gut is not designed to be abused. If I have any kind of, yeah, any kind of tap around the belly button, it's very sensitive. It's in bad, bad shape. Ah, ooh. Keep the change. Don't support panhandling. Yeah, I've seen that in... Oh no, not that one. That was not the one I wanted. Well, I'll keep it open if uh, there's not, if I can get a good shade spot. This parking really yields a lot of great shade.
get there early enough and I should probably get lucky. They, they uh, force people to clear out, which is pretty nice. They force people to, what? Oh, I suppose. I was thinking I could go straight. All right. Man, they love to separate the roads. <clears throat> hey, I think they, I think I know that guy. That's the bum. So, <clears throat> guts in pain. I gotta move slowly today. Today's, yesterday was such a waste. I don't, I, well, I recorded my gut pain and stuff. Re complaining about that issue. Oh man, I'm really sweating. I, I actually got somewhat lucky with uh, the issue of of the sun and the heat yesterday because I was in so much pain. I was sitting in my car most most of the morning, and at nine o'clock, like this time, I'd be sitting in my car in pain, and I'd also be sweating too. But it stayed cloudy and cool. Okay, yep, all right, yep, yep, um, I think I want the left lane, yeah, I think I want that left lane. Lewiston Business District, it's not too incredibly far, I bicycled it, I bicycled the, the distance. Okay, so slamming. Oh, too fast, too fast, too fast, too fast, too fast, too fast, too fast. Okay. It says 20. My speed was 23. Okay, 9. Hey, you got plenty of time on this one. Yeah, yesterday I didn't do much at all. I pretty much sat around in pain all day. Eventually gave in to aspirin. It's not exactly recommended to consume aspirin, but it doesn't exactly hurt. Do I take a left here? Uh, I don't know, maybe? There's the library. So then, yeah, I do. I'll wrap around. Oh, man. Yeah, yesterday with all the pain, I, I probably would have died. Sitting in my car, sweating and in pain. It just It's just a matter of getting all the right combinations in order to kill you. So that's, you just need the perfect combination. Okay, the sun will go down Okay, I know where the sun will go down, so parking right here isn't too bad. It may be sunny right now, but in the evening time, it'll be pretty good. Yeah. By about 4 p.m. or so, I'll, I'll, I should be completely in the shade. Wow, they certainly seem to have a lot going on around here. Those pipes sticking out. What kind of building do they have attached to, to the to the hillside? It's interesting. Poor rent. Too often I'll see kids climbing trees in the library. I'm a little upset about it because these are not climbing trees but I don't think I want to say anything some little redhead girl <clears throat> typical redheads artistic book box at a library all 
other ones I've seen have been bland. I never actually thought they would that uh, they'd have the idea to put art on it. That's a good idea. <clears throat> Mercantile store design like this. <clears throat> Pretty neat. The number of bicycle racks they have here is they lost their little free library box. That doesn't usually happen freely. Religious education building, the yellow house. Does that have to is that coordinated with the college? It's definitely attached to the church. Black Lives Matter. I don't know why more churches don't have the Ten Commandments somewhere displayed outside of their church. They got it etched in stone here. <clears throat> Not much of this bike stand is useful, especially the K. Even Keel, Lake Forest Park somewhere. It's seen better days. <clears throat> near Howard Street. This is tough. <clears throat> In one library there's this book on display or as an audio book by a black author. I didn't catch his name and I really want to check him out actually. I like I just like this the title uh, to the cover of his book. It said, Reposition Yourself. It's as simple as that. It must have been some kind of motivational thing. I never looked into it, but once again, I want to. I'm like, okay, it's it's really, it's, it's simple, but it really has a large message. It really has, has a meaningful message with that. It's not just simply, you know, from go from sitting on your left butt cheek to sitting on your right butt cheek it's it's more than that if, if that don't work then you, move, you do something else physically at least if you think of it on a physical level repositioning yourself doing different exercises is uh, very important right, it's a Thursday and they're they're closed so that's weird um, at this collective this is really weird this is something for sale some kind of weird three-wheel welded. I don't know if they allow, if they don't have any no trespassing signs. It's just kind of, they, they're advertised as a business and a lot is on display. The Bicycle Collective. They have definitely collected a lot. It doesn't really look too trashy. Keep out. Wow. <laughs> Neighbors are really doing some work. What kind of work is that? For piping? They had the digs that deep? The frost barrier per permeates that deep? <laughs> 75 out here. It'd be 85, just further south. I'm not sweating too bad. Very nice. This is a Palouse Mall. Free Wi-Fi. Hurricane Simulator. It's 3.30 in the afternoon on a Thursday. It's pretty quiet. <clears throat> All right, at this Walmart, I just had to jump a moat. Well, I didn't have to, I just took a bad way to walk over here. There are the campers. There's no signs discouraging camping. And it looks like they're just, <laughs> they're just, uh, lounging around on the, I don't know, the right side.
Making comments on the security here. Look at this, the bathrooms. Yeah, it doesn't say that the bathrooms are there, but you walk right through the electronic section to get to the bathrooms. No barriers. And you find a lot of Walmarts have to put barriers and gates. Not here. Probably no glass, oh, there's, well, the usual typical for games. No glass cases for the sleeping bags. So a great sign for high security or good clean places. The strap is not stolen. Everybody graduated from college. Yeah, it's still such a hustle and bustle around here. Maybe they're maybe they're just still remnants of college students. City of thirty thousand. Quite a large college population. I'm just kind of riding on the outskirts of the the city <clears throat> making a roundabout way to Walmart possibly it says Indian Hills Park and they got a very modern playground over there and I've reached the dead end of Indian Hills subdivisions I guess I'll take that right Blaine Street and something looks like they're extremely uh, successful in, in selling a subdivision of Indian Hills. <clears throat> Part of the, the reason that some, some subdivisions are successful is because of the name. I think these are cherries. We already ate one. Moscow is really busy. They must have some day labor here. Look at this old apartment complex. There was nothing before. <laughs> Just lines the whole walkway now, the whole trail. It's gonna have a lot of traffic. They're looking at a lot of traffic. Man, this thing doesn't end. Okay, there's the end. Join our list today, VIPidentitymoscow.com. Lots of apartments going up. Right next to the uh, university. <clears throat> Take a peek. So this is a growing area for students. What better place to stop at the university first than the campus information? Congratulations, vandals. Have fun stealing. Vandals. This is a pretty big one. This is impressive. All right, Administration Arboretum Golf Course Kitty Do Kitty Dome. It's all for kids. Maybe it's a teacher college. <clears throat> Lionel Hampton School of something. A hey, correction. I thought I saw Kitty Dome, but on another sign it said that it's Kid B and not Kid D. That changes my perception. It's a Greek. I don't know where to go exactly. It's a general. Downtown. Mm 
<clears throat> Some kind of a Greek lettering. This is like, like uh, this is a real college area. At least it's clean. We have a lot of Greek houses. I really like the Greek lifestyle. Whatever that involves. Bicycle air station next to this industry. They probably have to have a big heating complex. This is probably energy plant. It probably gets cold enough. So the main, I think the most entertaining central part is to, was over this way, back a little ways. Maybe I'll go through again. Healthiest cows can be found on university grounds. I've seen some healthy cows here. I have just passed through the university, pretty farmland on the university. I'm on Bill Chipman Palouse Trail. Not sure how long that goes for. I guess he chipped in some money. Alumnus. Interpretive line. So this is probably for frames, trains, and automobiles, trains. Lots of reading going in this direction. So take a look. University of Idaho. Go away vandals. Venus? Why do they got a sign talking about the planet Venus? <clears throat> okay. down the trail. Look at that sap. Milk of the poppy. Do I dare lick it? I know how strong it is. All right, I did lick a little bit, and it's bitter. I like it, actually, but I don't want to have too much because I know how strong it is. Milk of the poppy. I did spit some of it out, so it, just, it was just enough to touch my tongue to get that taste on the tip. I wonder if there's much processing that even needs to be done with uh, poppy milk in general because it's perfectly safe inside the plant. So, you extract it safely, you probably just go try to transfer the, the milk just directly to your veins. <clears throat> what the heck is this thing? Wait, so I'm just going to get a close-up of this first. I was going to continue down the sidewalk. Oh, it's got blades. Interesting. <clears throat> Some variety, massive variety of massive vehicles. Very specialized varieties of different um, models, too, different years. All on display at Case Agriculture. More on the other side. This is the, the wheat industry. I mean, wheat is just all over this area. 